Welcome back. We are talking about the Rolling Stone article on rape that sent shockwaves across the University of Virginia, but is now in dispute. I want you to imagine that you are interviewing the victim of a crime and that the victim does not want you to contact the criminals. Imagine that the victim is afraid of retaliation. What would you do? In this case, the Rolling Stone reporter, Sabrina Rudin Ederly, and her editors all agreed not to contact those alleged attackers. This defies a pretty basic journalistic principle. When someone is accused of wrongdoing, you make an effort to get their side of the story. Now, Rolling Stone regrets not doing so. So many people are questioning that reporting instead of questioning a culture that's permitted Jackie's story to happen in the first place.